First, you want to make a video about the nigga. Now, you want to add the nigga on Twitter. But what I really want to know, like, what we all want to know is, when y'all niggas going to get in them streets, bro? I done put 20 inside the sea. I pull up on you and I pop at your key. Look, I don't know what's up with Offset, bro. I really don't. And this is what I don't get, though. When Offset first came, like, when Amigos first arrived, bro, they was up and coming, they was hot. But at the same time, Takeoff and Quavo was really in the front line because Offset was always going to jail. He was always in and out. You didn't know what was up with him. So you hear about him jumping in the crowd, socking fans, out here beating up people back and forth to jail because he ain't taking no disrespect, no nothing. Everybody in the industry, like, look, Offset one of the real ones out the Migos. Like, out of everybody, all of them might be fly. They might look like they some busters, but, like, this is the real one out the Migos. Even when they was into it with Chief Keith, when the Migos bus got shut up, like, two, three years ago. Offset was the only one that went all the way to L.A. to meet up with Chief Keith to squash it when they took that little picture or whatever. I'm like, look, Offset one of them dudes, bro. Then he get back out. He still got his money. He still got his respect. But nowadays, he just looking like one of these Fugazi rappers that just want attention. How you gonna make a video about your boy, Lil Uzi? Don't say that's not your boy because you know it is, bro. You gonna make a video about him after he blessed y'all with a verse on that song and now you wanna make a post about him on Twitter? We don't know what you was doing. You was probably home bored or you probably just wanted spot. Lil Uzi don't mess with nobody. I don't care how y'all say he dressed. I don't care about his songs, how he look or whatever. Lil Uzi don't mess with nobody, bro. He ain't out here putting shame on people's records, trying to mess with people's girls, hating on other rappers, like none of that. He ain't doing nothing. He trying to be him. So I all said keep coming at him, bro. You looking like a bully and I don't like bullies. Half the world don't like bullies. You know what's going to happen after that, dude. Look, as a man, sometimes you just got to kick back and know when you're wrong. You knew you was wrong when you made the video, so you deleted it off your Instagram. So you come back and make a post about it because you probably felt sorry that everybody was on you. Like, man, why you delete the video? You said your word. Why you go back on it? Woo -woo -woo. If you ain't sincere about it, pick up the phone, my dude. Look, we know you a real one. Ain't no discredit to that. But a real man can easily tell somebody that he messed with, especially one of his friends or somebody he called one of his friends or one of his colleagues because that's what y'all are. This is your co-worker. Y'all in the same field. Y'all in the same industry. I don't care how nobody look at it. That's what it is. You can easily pick up the phone like, yeah, bro, I went too far in my bag. Come over. Let's blow up. Let's whatever. Squash it right then and there. Everybody don't need all this. Come on, man. Offset, you better than that. You still my dude. Y'all group still popping. Still one of my favorites. Ain't got no shame on you at all, bro. Just, just try to move a little different. DJ Ghost 100. I done put 20 inside the sea. I pull up on you and I pop at your key.